birthday for this Say for, for my fa uh, father, salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. For my father. For your father. Yes. <laughs> salam salam alaikum. So so. So so. Yes, Pavel Ashvili. Pavel Ashvili. Yes, salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. <laughs> so yeah. Thank you, bro. No problem. This one is private. Here we are. Here's the view. There's a little teapot that comes in, and then you have the tea, and then the baklava, and then the sugar. I think you put the cube in your mouth, and then you sip, you sip the uh, the tea. This will probably be hot. Mm. Afternoon, everyone. We're going to continue on our vlogs of uh, Baku City. Today we're going to take a quick look at the old city and the Maiden Tower, which is right beside me. Just a little fun fact, the apartment I'm staying um, is right there. We're staying there on the fifth floor, right there. So we're going to walk and see this near fountain. A lot of the fountains, but they're not seem to be on. I wonder if they do it at night. We'll take a look maybe later on. And there's a wall that goes around the old city. And I could have walked straight, but I looked on my Google Maps and it told me to walk in through this one. So we'll see where we're going. Beautiful places around here to just sit, relax. Coffee's everywhere. Everywhere, every other shop seems to be a place to get a coffee. Here's some modern signs here. Puppet Theater, National History Museum of Azerbaijan, Seaside Boulevard. You can walk there for the metro. And Maiden Towers this way. Five minutes, 410 meters. Let's see, I wonder if we have to pay to get in or no, I think it's just for cars. Oh wow, this is a very nice park. Like there's so many nice look at the police little box there. There's so many nice little places in here. And there's stalls on the side. Salam. Little stalls on the side for souvenirs. Hello, sir. Salam alaikum. How are you? Um, not right now, but in a couple of days, I want to go to the fire. You know the fire? The fire. This, this, you mean? Such as I made a film. Yes. Um. This you mean? Um, fire temple. We have like a uh, not the fire temple. These ones. This yeah. one. Here. Oh yeah, yeah. This old one. Too. Derek, the fire yeah. mountain. The only fire mountain. And so, uh, yeah. Bro, For can one. I filming? Yeah. Can I filming? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Go ahead. There we go. Say hello. Hello. Salam. Salam. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. Here we go. So yeah. Thank you. No problem. We have uh, the first oil well. Yeah. For this price, you will need all these places. Okay. Uh, we're also making twenty percent discount. Uh, you will visit this place, this place, this place, this place. I will pay for uh, ninety manat. We are making twenty percent discount. We will make. Yeah, you will also get lunch and tickets to all these places. You know, if you will take this one with like price without lunch and tickets, you will like have to pay for this place fifty manat. What is it? This one. That's a GoPro camera. Yeah, yeah, this, this, this. Oh, it's for the wind. Ah. So uh, the sound doesn't bother yeah, it when yeah, the wind yeah, is hot. So yeah, if you buy this one, we're also giving like uh, the night tour. This one absolutely for free. You will like not have to pay money for this one. Okay. It's absolutely for free. We have it today. So yeah, if you want to like make a deposit or something, if you want to buy it today, we're giving like night tour, so you can visit night tour. Too. You will like, uh, you will like have uh, you know in a night tour, offline park, carpet museum. Okay. 
yeah, you will visit. And what's this one for fifty five? It, it is priced with all lunch and tickets, you know. Yeah. You will get like Price no lunch, and yeah, you will have to like pay for this. Say for for my fa uh, father, salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. For my father. For your father. Yes. <laughs> salam alaikum. So so. So so. Yes, Pavel Ashvili. Pavel Ashvili. Yes. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. <laughs> So yeah. Thank you, bro. No problem. This one is probably without lunch and tickets. Like it costs <laughs> like cheaper, but you yeah. you will have to like pay ten minutes for there, ten minutes for there. <laughs> and yeah, and you will get like no lunch. But for ninety minutes, you will get tickets to all these places. You get in lunch. You get in professional language uh, English language guide. And also we, will, we are picking up from hotel from this. Bus, Where are you from? By the way? last model. Ireland. Ireland. Yes. Oh, I have. I had a girlfriend from Ireland. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we're picking like from this one course and it, like giving night tour of the full thing. Okay. Uh, so Ireland, your, like call, okay. Call uh, let, <laughs> let me let me let me see. I, I just I just came here yesterday. I'm sorry. Oh. I oh. can. So yeah, you know different companies will yeah. offer you the same thing like without yeah. inclusive. Okay. Or only our company has all inclusive like lunch, tickets and also it's 90 mana. Okay. We're making discount. Our office is like from uh, two minutes from there. Yeah. So okay. if you want like for more discount you can come to the office. Okay, well are you here all the time or the office? Because I'm like right stay right in the apartment by far. But I'm just here today. I wanna see I wanna go maybe Today Saturday, like maybe Monday or Tuesday. Oh, okay. thinking about that time. Yeah. Okay. Can I keep this? Yeah, yeah, of course. Okay. Of course. What's your name? Kina. Kina? Yeah. Okay. If you want, you can take my number. Okay. Like, so if you want like more discount, I will uh, like uh, message me in a WhatsApp. Oh yeah. I so I can tell my manager too. Yeah. My phone. This one. Okay. Add contact. Yeah. What's your name? Very good. Have a nice day. Sir. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, don't know if I'll go ahead. The first guy we sort of met there, but he was they were nice kids. So we'll see. There's a lot of souvenirs. There's a you get uh, drinks there too, and that. So anyway, so take a little bit uh, overwhelming just walking in and getting that. I wasn't expecting that. So I don't. Know. We'll see. I want to go to the towers. So ninety minot is about forty five euros. It's a bit pricey, but the air one was 55, which is about 25, which is sort of what Gabriel the Traveler did on his tours, and he said he didn't do the lunch and that. So, they're giving free coffee. There you go. Lovely. These are what up? potatoes on a stick. Now, I'm still full from lunch. Went and had a picture, a great lunch at a Azerbaijani restaurant just near the Fountain Square. It was really good. You can watch that video. I'll have that up on there. Just go into my uh, Azerbaijani uh, vlogs. I'll have them all there on the same one, including some shorts and that. Azerbaijani cuisine. So this is the old town. Really nice. Ka, ka. Nice. Really nice. So well, look at all the fairy lights here. So when they're up, I like the streets and all the cobblestone. No, it's real music, so no copyright strike there. So, so you can have you something to drink and eat with YF music. Here's more Carpet Brothers store. Wow, look at these purses and that, eh? Wow. I'd see this is very touristy prices. You probably find them off the beaten path. A little bit easier. Thank you for
Brothers souvenirs. Really nice stuff in there. Might get something for Kira and Shauna to bring back home. Hopefully they don't wreck the house. <laughs> Stalls walking around. There's a nice, lovely door frame. Too bad they have a modern lock on it, but I guess the modern lock would be more secure than Salam. And here's the tower. I'm going to try to get up in there, see how much it costs. <laughs> and there again, fire tower, fire the flame uh, towers. You can see them there, you can see them all over the city. And there's the, uh, there's the promenade just there. A tea house. Ooh. Maybe you get a nice tea house. Cup of tea. I haven't had a... Azerbaijani tea yet. So, I think I should. Maybe we can uh, get up to the tower first. Look at the restaurant. Museum Terrace restaurant. Here's your man with the. Uh, <laughs> How do you get in? Let's see if I can figure out how to go for the tour the maid well walk up to me and here we go. I'll turn it off and I'll ask them about to go up to the Maiden Tower. Okay, so it was 15 minutes to go to the Maiden Tower. I think you're going out from there. For a foreign citizen, obviously the Azerbaijani is less. So I'm assuming we go here. You can buy, uh, there's four museums that you can go into. And that would be, I think, thirty-two fifty. I think, for a foreign citizen. There's family rates, group rates, uh, children's rates, and stuff like that. So, let's see what this is like. I wonder if we can get up to the top. We'll see. It's a nice, cool day now. Um, really nice. I wonder how you get in there. I wonder... Oh, you won't drown. No, that must have been the same entrance where people were going in. So, it looked like a lot of people were leaving it. So, 15 euros for our 15 minute, which is about 7 euros for the Maiden Tower. Oh, look at this historical state architecture. Here's a, the Maiden Tower here. Very nice. And I think you go into the Maiden Tower from here. At least people are leaving from there. So we'll give it a shot. Maybe we'll get to the top. Yeah. No food and drink. Go clockwise. Hello. Hello. Have 
ticket here. Yeah, well, thank you, and just go up. Oh, Ireland. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Okay. Oh, very tight. <laughs> I guess people going in and up, do the same. So now, under, okay. Don't know if you can see this. So there'd be slits there. Arrows and stuff. See if we can keep going up. The stairs opens up into a flat area. Okay, but we want to keep going up. Now we still go up. Keep going up. You need your exercise, anyways. Still go up higher. Quite a lot of stairs. So that's the top of the Maiden Tower. Uh, it was 15 minot, which is like seven euros. Well worth it. Get a view of this whole beautiful city. So the things, uh, during my vlogs, you'll see me on the promenade and stuff like that. You can high weight them out. There's the flame towers in front of us. So at night it will look fabulous. 
you'll see that that'll be one of my vlogs too. I'm gonna take the vernacular up to the top, go around there, watch the plant towers, and then show you what it looks like at night too. Uh, so that's coming up. And there's that building. It looks like the Sydney and uh, Australia on the waterfront. There's another building up there. I don't know what that is. Interesting looking. Like the buildings are just fabulous. And there's the Azerbaijan flag. It's a huge one. And it's definitely well worth it. Like it's a great view after the climb of stairs. It's nice fresh air here. And then on this side, we have the whole promenade. Look at all the people down the promenade now, as opposed to we were on the other vlog in the morning. There's the bouncy castles for the kitties. They're all running around, jumping up there in the beautiful skyline. So definitely worth the view. Now, I'm just gonna make my way down. Okay, so I'm here at the tea. And they can't just get a tea, you have to have tea and some things. So to our seat. I'm taking a seat of four. I just wanted to be by the promenade here. People walking around with the main tower right behind us. So we were just up there just a few minutes ago. And we're already back down here. So I'm gonna get try a cup of tea. Of tea. It comes in a little glass and a baklava, of course. You can always have a baklava. There's a little teapot that comes in. And then you have the tea and then the baklava. And then the sugar. I think you put the cube in your mouth. And then you sip, you sip the uh, the tea. This will probably be hot. Mmm, very good. So you keep the sugar cube in your tongue, and you sip the uh, tea, and then we'll enjoy the baklava. Mmm. It's very nice. It's a, it's like a floral tea, if that makes any sense. Very nice. I'm gonna sit and enjoy this, and I'll have the baklava after I get rid of the uh, the sugar in my mouth. Hmm. Didn't even look at the price. I don't know what it is. So, wonder if I will be shocked. I'll let you know towards the end how much it cost. I just finished the first tea and I poured the second one. So the cubes are different than we'd have in, you know, the Western world, where the cubes would dissolve. This, these ones actually stay in your mouth quite a long time and they dissolve slowly. So it fits with the cup of tea that you're having. So let's try the baklava. Mm. Very good. Mm. Very rich. But it's not overly sweet. It's good. It's a nice texture. Mm. Very good. Go back to my second cup of tea and get another cube of sugar and put it in my mouth. That was 1320, which is about seven euros. It's a big pot of tea. I drank four. And I could have probably, there still had some in it, but that was very good tea. Baklava was nice, so. I uh, gave him a, a fair tip, so. Wonder what's up here as I'm walking around. Let's just go walk up here for a bit before we go in. We have to meet Emily at seven o'clock by the big statue. Cause she doesn't have a eSIM card, so. She can only function on, she can only function on, uh, when we're at hot spots. Here's some of the old part of the city. This looks nice, eh, from here? Look at those domes. I'll we'll take a walk up here, see what we say. And then you get a better view of the Maiden Tower right there. Now I think we're lucky when we got in because I think it closes soon. So museum in Shisha. Not a fan of those. Although that being said, I never tried it, but I'm not into smoking anymore. So 
see this garbage. Yeah, put that in, in there. These are nice little things, eh? Wow. Boutique Hotel, five star. Wow, Sultan Inn. Really. Wow, this is lovely. Coffee Gallery. Police. Saffron Sweet House. Look at those hats. Hotel. So These are carpets and st stuff. Look at the little oh, windows there down. Oh. There's another one here. Some antiques. Little scales. I really like the old buildings. And the cobblestone road, of course. It's a jewelry place. West End. Wow. Baku Law Center. And just more roads going up there out of the touristy part. I think I'll make my way back, head towards where Emily is. But hope you're enjoying this uh, Azerbaijan uh, vlogs. There will be several videos made out of them. So make sure you hit the subscribe and the like, especially the, the like button. It tells YouTube that you like it and it spreads it out through the algorithm. So hopefully I get more views. And if you want to be a member of the uh, channel, it helps me out a lot. I think it's like 2 2 euros and 99 cents. It's not even a cup of coffee a month. And it really helps my channel and it helps me bring more content. I have lots of stuff coming up. I still want to do the sailboat, uh, the fisherman with the, the lobster or crab or the mussel fisherman for a day, the farm. I want to stay with a farmer for 24 hours. I want to uh, also, in June, I'm going to be hitchhiking to the Iron Islands and sleeping in a tent and also glamping there. And also, we have September coming up. We have uh, Pakistan in September and October. We have the, uh, I'm flying into Paris and we're going to see how many countries I could visit in eight days. I think I can get seven with the, using the trains buses and staying in hostels so stay with me for that and hope you're enjoying all these adventures we're taking bye for now here's a nice building didn't see it on the way back going to the uh, maiden tower but look at it love the uh, I think it's copper on the side of the building it's turned green you have the cat chasing the pigeons and then you have the figures in the three windows. And then the woodwork around with the uh, stained glass. And then the gallery on top with the balcony and the trees. Really nice. So that's why it's always important to walk back. You know, you can catch something that you will miss the first time. Yeah, this is where we were coming down before. Let's head back then. Thought I'd throw that up there. This was really a spectacular building. Remember we walked through this on the way earlier on. The lights weren't on. 
Now the fairy lights are on. Gives it a different appearance. Look at this. These are all the kiosks selling the, uh, the wares and you have music blaring in that. It's a lot more festive atmosphere. Just wanted to show you what it looks like on the way in. Here's another part of the old city. This is what it shows when they're excavating it and what it looks like now underneath. Very interesting and here we are above it. You see these domes all around. Very interesting. I love the floor. Very well done. Very Queen City. And they have these little stalls everywhere selling their wares. A lot of carpets, a lot of carpet, like little knickknacks you can take home with you with uh, little purses or handbags that are from carpets converted. So definitely an interesting city to come visit. Uh, once you get here, it's, the price is not too bad. Um, it was a long trip for us. Oh, Tourist Information Center. So there's another place you can go and see and get some information. I'll be doing that tomorrow. Doing some sussing out because I'm going to do that. Um, I'm going to do the fire pit uh, tour thing. That's a whole day job. So we'll be doing that coming up next few days. Maybe when Tuesday or Wednesday.